Well, if you haven't heard of a mashup, it's what happens when you combine various forms of entertainment and create something entirely new from it. Well, chess and boxing may well be the strangest mashup of all. Here's our Europe Bureau Chief, Tara Nelson. It's fight night in North London. Boxers are ready, the crowd is hyped. Matt Crazy Arms Reed isn't doing so well, though. At six foot six and 80 kilos, he doesn't exactly have a boxer's build. But Matt actually doesn't need to land a punch to win this bout. And that's a great move. Because between every round of boxing, the players pause for four minutes of chess. And that's a check. Matt puts Sebastian in a check for the first time in the game. Chess boxing might be London's weirdest underground sport. It's still so new in the UK, most of the spectators here have never even seen it before. What I like about it is the switch between there's kind of mental facility and then the physical and then having to switch back. Six rounds of chess, five rounds of boxing, but you can win at either. It's checkmate or knockout, whoever gets there first. Just 60 seconds now. You're nearly there. You're doing good. It might sound bizarre, but people are lining up to try it. I regard chess as the ultimate uh, battle of the mind, ultimate mind sport, if you like. And boxing is the ultimate physical sport. And I think by combining those two things together, you've got something very special. Uppercut and the hook. Now you go. Uppercut. Bike messenger Sasha Wankowski loves the challenge. Like Matt, he now competes. But after seven rounds, with the chess match ending in a draw, Sasha can't make his brawn work for him. The frustration for Sasha is knowing his brains could have helped him earlier. I had an advantage in chess and I lost it. I mean, that's actually the, the tricky thing with boxing and chess combined. You have, to be, you have to be really focused. So what about Matt? Well, he has a secret under his belt. He manages a chess shop for a living. His fancy footwork happens on the board. say it's the thinking person's contact sport and it's allowing more than a few former so-called geeks to finally exact revenge and i was kind of happy because it was a it was a it was a blow to the boxes and it was a huge sort of uh, uh, accomplishment for chess players everywhere that you know they can do this sort of thing tara nelson global news london